I believe they don't want the truth to come out. I don't think McCarthy wants to be subpoenaed to talk about that conversation he had on the phone with Trump or some of the other things he said during the day about Trump being to blame for it. That's Nevada Representative Dina Titus speaking on CNN today about legislation to create a commission that would investigate the January 6th attack on the Capitol. The commission would look a, a lot like the one that investigated the 9-11 attacks uh, 20 years ago. It's expected to pass the House. ABC's Mary Alice Parks reports on the bigger question, can it pass the Senate? Four months after supporters of then-President Trump breached the inner chambers of Capitol Hill, sending lawmakers running and threatening the former vice president, Members of Congress now set to approve a 9-11 style commission with subpoena power to investigate exactly what happened on that fateful day and what led to the violence. The House will be in order. Speaker Pelosi celebrating a breakthrough deal, equal wishes. representation between Democrats and Republicans and a limited scope just focused on the insurrection. Republican Congresswoman Liz Cheney telling ABC's John Carl after she was ousted from GOP leadership that she welcomes the news. And Republican leader Kevin McCarthy should be prepared to take the stand. He absolutely should, and, and I wouldn't be surprised uh, if he were subpoenaed. I think that he very clearly and said publicly that he's got information about uh, the president's uh, state of mind that day. But this week, Republican leaders now throwing cold water on the commission idea. McCarthy on Fox News making it clear after a deal was reached that he's not in favor of a commission. What about all the riots that have led up throughout the summer, that the unrest from BLM, Antifa and others? On January 6, after lawmakers were finally able to return to work, McConnell said this. They tried to disrupt our democracy. They failed. They failed. But today, he argued there are already enough other investigations. Law enforcement investigations are ongoing, and federal authorities say they expect to arrest at least 100 or so more. Bipartisan investigations are also underway and have been for months. This opposition from Republican leaders on Capitol Hill comes after former President Trump also publicly opposed the idea of the commission. Mary Alice Parks, ABC News, Washington.